Yeah, total pyramid scheme. All right, here we go. 2020 Chronicles Baseball, eight box break, number six. Pick your teams. These are your teams. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate it. Good luck to you. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, insurance is something. I really, uh, for the most part, when I got through the first swing and then through the shit show of the collapse, I really appreciated the mortgage game. <clears throat> I think it's it's funny. My wife's like uh, almost five years younger than I am, and <laughs> she seems to think that mortgage rates have always been like sub five percent. Interest rates are always super low, and you can borrow money very cheaply. No. But when I started, rates were low. And they were, prime was at seven and a quarter. We just refinanced for two nine. Like, no. Two eight seven five. But, like, it's fucking nuts. You don't even know. Like, you don't even know what it's like to borrow money. You're, we're being given a gift right now. You can borrow money at 3 to 4%, and your average return is like, over the past five years, what, Shane? 12, 14? Conservatively, oh, I guess I don't think we can think of certain administration for any of that. If we could, I think it'd be Bush. But it doesn't matter. Like regulation, deregulation, whatever.
that's really i mean it, think back to when you started doing it you never gave out in anything at 275 unless it was some kind of weird ass option arm with a three year prepayment penalty 77 16 5 Reaganomics kicked in and they got up to the 20s in what 82 it just uh it, it really wasn't that long ago the markets really aren't that different based on the same principles they go up they go down inflation still exists no matter how much quantitative easing they do it's still there I'm like we're all very lucky that we're locked in at our race right now God, yeah. Interest rates that high, CDs all day. I mean, 86, 87. That's probably very middle class. Very. $200 a week. Can you imagine that now? We're sitting fat. Inflation hasn't kicked in yet. We got the Fed covering our ass. I think we've had like nine sessions of quantitative easing over the last 10 years. That's ridiculous. Interest rates should be like 27% right now. <clears throat> the cost of milk should be like $9. Anything from China should be infinitely more than it costs right now. We're really, really fucking lucky. But it's going to hit the fan. It always does. Yeah. Yep. Um, there was the weird Brexit period where no one was doing anything and it was kind of fucking up everything. But yeah, the whole world is. It's just a giant misinterpretation of how much money really is worth. guys are going to shoot me down conspiracy lane here pretty quickly. Well, 
Well, that's even rough too, because that's like a war. Ooh, that's sick. Chris Paddock. That's sick. Mike Trout, silver out of mosaic. God, Chronicles is like a beautiful shit show. Andrew Stevenson. Dubon, Justin Dunn. Brandon Belt. Yoshimoto. Cunha. To 99. That's a good one. To 49, Tristan Lutz. Nice patch. Sparkly. Did it? Man, that's pretty good. I should check my balance. I think I still have some in there. I bought a bunch when it was at like eight. <clears throat> Juan Soto. Joey Vato. Kino Phoenix. Yoshimoto to 50. I don't know. Um, to me, that has to be more of a conversation of what do you believe and what are you comfortable with? And then after that, giving an opinion uh, Aquino if you feel like one is still needed Harrell Cotton Jarrell Aaron Judge to 99. Logan Allen. Cleveland. I just, I don't understand why they put everything upside down. One way, the other way.
Um, me too. Me too, my man. Uh, let's see. Tracking. It's very expensive. Um, Overnight Saturday. Uh, do, 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 do. Ooh, nice. In transit on schedule for one thirty PM. Outbound. Currently in St. Charles. I don't know if they've got the airfield there. That was at 5.30. Yeah, it's probably in the air right now down to Jack's. Orioles have some good stuff. Oh, there's another one of those. Steve Garvey again. Boys of Summer. Andrew Stevenson, 99. Jose Altuve, Cody Bellinger, to two ninety nine. Tristan Lutz, Juan Soto, Joey Gallo. It's Juan Soto, not on like a Tatis level. Or Acuna. There he is, Acuna. Nice. Uh, to 99. Right, wins a World Series at 21, plays in a huge market. Um, he's fun and exciting. It, it, I don't get it. Oh, shit, to 75. Joey Votto, Jersey. Josh Bell, Pink, to 25. Pretty special. You gotta think like if that's a football player, that's a sophomore in college. <laughs> Do 
doing those things. Is that Collins, White Sox? Jordan, Mosaic. Oh yeah, I think there's. Um, I believe it'll be here tomorrow. I think it'll definitely be here tomorrow. Uh, Rico Garcia to 199 Sean Murphy EG Minter Atlanta Aquino Mosaic God I'm in love with Mosaic We should do some more football. Tyler Stevenson. Reds. Gene Carlos Stanton. Postseason killer to 25. Quite get him there this time. Juan Soto. Silhouette jersey. Oh, yeah. Well, definitely not worried about it. Uh, but yeah, those things will, will be sold out in a second. Have you watched any today? Chapman, I haven't seen any. Jordan, Zach Collins, I think that's the second one. Nathaniel Lowe. Sure, there's a a few more one on ones left. The swoosh is nice. Ibrahim Toro to twenty five. Jorge Soler. Yoshitomo to 75. Ryan Edwards.
Well, I mean, it makes sense, right? Everything's digital. Cursive has been rightly so drawn out of school. There are more, much more important things to study than writing fancy. Um, especially when everyone types. Still need to know how to write in case computers go down. Got to carve some shit on some stone. Dustin May, Jordan Alvarez to 50. But really, how important is really knowing how to sign your name? In 10 years from now, when the young people are actually into signing their name. <clears throat> when you say we, do you say we as Americans or do you say we as humans? Yoshitomo. My answer to both is the same. No, I don't. Jonathan Villar to 99. Like United States Americans or the Americas? Alex Bregman to 99. When's the last time? Cunha and Vlad. Well, I mean, I think the same thing that could be said now. What if those people were now taught to write, but not giving a writing utensil because they were never learned or taught how to type or to sign a digital document. They didn't have that knowledge. So now they're behind on that, but then now they know how to do this. So it's like, it's what's now that matters, I think. What are we doing now? What's happening next? How do we prepare for that? Joe Adele, learn from what we did before. How did that work? Should we keep doing that? Should we not do that? Should we keep that in our pocket? Maybe that will work in a certain scenario. Let's not eradicate that. Hitler, that was wrong. Like All that shit. It's good and important, but... So what? You weren't taught the same things your parents were. Logan Allen. Definitely weren't taught the same things your grandparents were. It really wasn't that long ago. Shit changes. Fast. Uh, that's it. <laughs> Education. Yeah, me neither. Uh, that is it on this one. Thank you, everybody. Uh, I have another case. I'm going to throw it in the store um, probably on Monday. <laughs>